Hello my friends. I'm going to be doing a flip cup on this round canvas, but first I have a couple of announcements to make. First of all, I am close to reaching my goal of 20,000 subscribers. And as promised, I'm going to be doing a giveaway, a big giveaway when I reach that number. So stay tuned because on my next video, probably I will be um, showing you the pieces that um, I'm going to give away and give you details about how you can win. So watch for that, please. And secondly, I just want to share some kind of exciting, fun news with you. For the first time, I decided to enter our local county fair, the Santa Barbara County Fair. And um, my husband and I went to go to the fair the other day, and I was so happily surprised, though, to see that I had won a first place ribbon. And here is the painting. And best of show. <laughs> now, I'm giggling because... These were not my best works ever, but um, I did decide that animals would be the way to go to with the county fair being, you know, a lot of animals involved. So uh, I think that had something to do with my good fortune. And um, so that was great fun. I just wanted to share that with you. I've seen, you've probably seen both those paintings before. So today, flip cup on this canvas, I'm using... Um, apple barrel, pouring medium. I've mixed it two parts, pouring medium, one part paint, a little water if needed. Uh, pretty much using artist or master's touch paints in pale blue, cobalt blue, and rouge. And, oh, two, here's another one. Um, I wanted a warm yellow, so I took yellow and added a little bit of orange to it. Come up with this color, and I'm using. Oh, I told you that rouge, white, and lastly uh, some prism pour in Egyptian blue. Now that was a little thinner. I had to add some glue to it to um, make it as thick as these other ones. And I think my consistencies are pretty similar. I'll show you. It's uh, got to be thick enough to hold the shape of the cells I want to get, but thin enough to spread out easily enough. So two to one plus a little water seem to work. Now I'm going to pour, I'm going to do a flip cup, just one big one in this big cup I have in here leftovers from the animal, uh, the balloon animal video I did the other day. I scraped up all the drippings and put it in here. And this is what I have left, maybe about a half an inch worth. I'm just going to add to that, even though it's different. Um, I, that was Artist Loft ready mix, pour paints, no medium added, but what the heck, I'm going to try it. So here, I'm just going to do a dirty pour in this order. I did add silicone, two drops of silicone to all but the yellow and the white. Since I used basically the primaries, although I'm heavy on the blue, I should end up with uh, really all sorts of colors on here because they will mix and blend together. Whoops, uh-oh, that was sloppy. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. How did I manage that? Hopefully I didn't lose too much over there. Maybe I ought to scrape it up and add it to my canvas here. How did I manage to do that? 
Oh well, it's just going to be kind of muddy when I get here, so never mind. All right. Um, I think I'll hit it with the torch before I tilt. And probably again afterwards. I think this apple barrel medium is very reactive. Cells are very, very tiny, but um, they will grow as I tilt. Boy, I hope I got enough um, paint for this surface. Hmm. Oh, well. Let's see. See how they're growing as I move the paint around on the canvas. I like those yellow ones over there, peeking through those other colors. Get rid of this mess over here. Kind of walk it back and forth until that goes away. There we go. Now this mess. I'll worry about, I'll do this next and then I'll worry about that one final edge. Okay, lots of cells. I don't think I like this. I need that to go away. Yet, I'm going to distort the cells. I really like the appearance of these here and here, but um, if I want to get rid of that, I'm going to have to sacrifice the, the shape of some of those. But maybe if I kind of slowly go back and forth, I can kind of maintain the part I like. It's almost gone. There we go. Oops. Okay. Oh, I rather like this. You see all the colors I ended up with. Lots of green came through with a mixture of the the blue and the blues and the yellow. Got purple here. I think there's good contrast um, between the light and the dark. I want to kind of just change that line that's going across, make it a little wavy. There, that's pretty good. This will probably be one of the pieces I give away. I have a bunch of rounds that will be in the running. Yeah, I, I like that kind of swoop there. Let me bring in for a closer look. Okay. 
as I said, this um, apple barrel pouring medium is very, very reactive to just a very small amount of silicone. I like it. I think it's a fun piece. I hope you like it too. And thank you for watching, my friends. I look forward to seeing you next time.